Ain't shoot a ball. Ain't just a ball right in. Just a ball. We have an easy come. Ask me what block I'm from. I tell y'all the block where we can afford the be. So I start waking up, put a Confederate flag in front of my trap house, and I ain't get raided once. Yeah, it get like that here. It get like that. To impress none of y'all niggas, I don't lie. I done stepped on coke to stretch the supply. A rugged nose when a Reggie was live. Even diluted PCP. If God could walk on water, so can I. Watch. Watch. Easy to block, Captain. You already know, man. It's late night edition. We got to we gotta put it out tomorrow. John John, the Don has put in game out bullpen. You know, we got John John versus Cassidy. We got T Rex versus Bad News. We got Tay Rock versus um, Clone. Make sure y'all go grab that pay per view and all that. But y'all know we here. We got to talk about what just happened. So, first of all, I'm going to keep it a dollar. Y'all know, y'all know I don't like these niggas anyway. But I'm going to keep it a dollar. Number one, face off start at 11. And it wasn't just starting at 11. It stated it, stayed, it was starting at 9. Then we got the 9 with the 9.30. Then we got the 9.30 with the 9.45. We got the 9.45 with the 10.15. We got the 10.15. Y'all get the drift. <laughs> it, it, it started to 11. So no, niggas had niggas waiting like we were getting some joys. One. You know what I'm saying? Then when we get on there, the title... John, John, you already know how the culture is, bro. You can't put Cassie. You know, by 11, you know Cass not coming. By 11, you know Cass not coming. So the title, you can't put Cassie, John, John, face off. You know he's not coming because you know that's what we there for. We get Tay Rock first, first draw. That's that's how you already knew it was already a bad draw. When the, the third the third battle is the first face-off, you already know, like, all right, something going on. Listen, y'all niggas got to start showing up the face-offs, though, bro. It's the promotion. Y'all don't promote all of it, all week, all these. If y'all got to do anything the day before the, day before the battle, y'all got to at least promo. Come on, Rex. Everybody stay in Atlanta. Everybody in Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? Y'all really killing John John Carr. I I'm gonna keep it a dollar. Y'all killing this card, bro. Y'all killing it. I don't know who don't who don't like this nigga or dislike this nigga or whatever or what he did to somebody, but y'all are killing it. No promotion, no nothing. This jaw is this jaw. I I hope he got a good event, bro. I hope he got a good event. 11 o'clock come, we get we get the clone and 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 and, and the Tay Rock face off. That's cool. Chain sounding all crazy. Clink, 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 clink. Like them joints aluminum. Like the bow out of the jaws. Yeah, and shit. You know what I'm saying? Them jaws make like them jaws make like them echoes, man. <laughs> Nigga start walking, you go, you gotta start doing that shit. And all of that, you got the little, you got the little fucking, you got the little fucking ugly John in the back. Just a bad, it's a bad John, you know what I'm saying? That was a bad John. I got clone with a 30, too. I got clone with a 30. And all of that. But, you know, y'all niggas, but back to that, but back to that, back to the, you know, I got sidetracked in my phone, y'all got sidetracked Main event, no promo, no face off. Co main event, no promo, no face off. Cassidy say he the promo guy. We know Rex, he could talk his shit. No, both the niggas that you need to do promo, don't be doing any promo. Bro, that's crazy. That's crazy. And for the card to call end game, it's supposed to be a big card. Me personally, Johnny, I'm gonna keep it a man. I bang with you. You know, I text you, I say, yo, man, congratulations on the card, but I'm gonna keep it a dollar. When I seen the VIP started like like three bands. <laughs> I was like, yo, this nigga try, you try to eat. Three thousand, these niggas regular niggas. They barely want to pay $50 to get in that job. Three bands, two bands, 1500 1800 You know, I did a VIP for 400 I think. And that came with, what, two bottles? 
in like a cabana and like three tickets because I know like I ain't trying to overcharge nobody. Eighteen hundred is crazy. I ain't gonna lie, eighteen hundred I'm popular, but I'm not knocking it. Buy it, buy it, everybody, buy it. If you can afford it, but buy it. But business wise, we gotta start thinking like that. Like yo, the average nigga working person nine to five niggas not going to just have eighteen eighteen hundred dollars twenty five hundred dollars to spend on no vip and not to see no fucking cash and keep it a dollar again i think we should take we should take from this is i don't know what the money situation was but to me it was like when niggas don't come to a face-off and they know they signed the contract and they know they, they contract say, yo, you get penalized for the for the face-off, you don't come because the, the big part of the actual battle either she lets me know that niggas didn't get paid enough or niggas is being disrespectful. I'm a league owner as well, so I have to say this. Niggas got to start getting hit. Niggas got to start getting penalized, bro. Like, you you have to, we have to enforce the contracts. As league owners, we got to enforce the contract. So if you really sent the nigga a contract and say, yo, 10%, you don't show up for the face-off, after the battle, literally take the 10%, bro. Because when you be like, no, I'm going to give it to you. It was a good battle. It's like you letting them niggas know that they could do the same shit over and over and over. No, you got to enforce it. I knew that nigga wasn't coming though. I ain't gonna lie. I was on Facts Live. The nigga K Walker um comments and says, I'm on the phone with the nigga now. Told y'all that shit was like 9 30 at night. I'm like, what? Face off gonna start at fucking what? No, it's supposed to start out first it was nine. The nine is a that was just a bad situation. Yo, man, go grab them paper views and grab them tickets. I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna grab. We, we, we going, to, we definitely gonna tighten up. We gonna tighten up. I'm gonna see if I can put it on the TVs. Now, everything right now is going against the event. Now we need a good event for tomorrow. We need a good event tomorrow. We need niggas to start on time. I'm gonna tell you how to fix this. Whatever time on that flyer, the event has to start. Whatever time on that flyer, the event has to start on that time. We need every battle to be good. Because now, there's no promo for the actual battle, but you can still sell the card after the battle. That's why we go, That's why it's called the video on demand. A lot of times, you know, the day after and then the day after after that, a lot of people grab the pay-per-view. So, I mean, like, it's, it's not totally lost, but battles have to be good. I don't even know what I'm doing. Up it's like 12, 30, what time is it? It's like 12, 12 in the morning. How y'all know? On a Friday, waiting to see John John and fucking Cassidy fucking argue, because I'm like, cool. At least I get to see that. At least I get to see that. I don't even get to see that. 